Hey all, this is Damon at Reliable Subaru in Springfield, Missouri. Today we're going to talk about the 2022 WRX and the complete redesign that is this vehicle. The big change for this year that everyone's talking about is the change to the tur turbocharged 2.4 liter Boxer 4 that we're using. This engine is shared with the Outback Turbo and the Ascent. It's a 271 horsepower unit, which of course is up from the previous 2 liter Boxer 4 that we used in the previous generation to this vehicle. Of course, you still have the top mount intercooler on here to cool off that air as it goes into the intake. Again, 271 horsepower, that's a big change from what it was uh, previously. Now, the engine note on this has changed. That is something everybody uh, talks about, but it is still obviously a, a Subaru WRX that you're listening to when it's running. Now, of course, this is a complete redesign from last year's model and, of course, going back to 2015. As we look around, you see all the different changes from the headlights and the front bumper all the way around to the body cladding, which has been controversial with some people, but in the dark colors, you can see it really blends in really well, and it looks really, really nice. They did a great job on this car. It looks a lot better in person than the press pictures that we have all seen and then were discussed online. This particular one is the limited model, so it does have the sunroof, uh, it has the leather and Alcantara seats, which we'll get into in just a little bit. As we go around, we can see more of those body lines and how they've changed it. More aggressive design on the side as the rear quarter panel kind of flares out, gives a much more distinguished look um, and more aggressive. We go around to the rear, complete redesigned tail lights, uh, the rear bumper, and of course you still have those quad exhausts. So looking at it from the back, you still know it is a WRX, but it just looks like a much more premium vehicle than what the previous model was. Now with the WRX, it does have a nice large trunk as always, so it is still a usable sports car. It cuts in a little bit here more than what the previous one did, but that's just part of the, the styling. But inside you still have lots and lots of room for luggage for, you know, a vacation or a couple day trip or anything like that. You have the trunk mounted spoiler right there, which adds to the features of the vehicle, makes it look a little bit more completed. And as we look down the three quarter, you really see those lines and how the, the, the fenders flare out, which gives it just a, a wonderful look that I personally really, really enjoy. And a lot of people do too. Everyone here has been really enamored by it. We've got the new design on the wheels there, which again, they look better than what they used to look. Um, just going for a more premium feel over what the previous models were. As we go inside, you see the complete redesign on the interior, which they really, really knocked it out of the park. Um, the, from the air, air vents, to the seats, to the steering wheel, to the 11.6 inch touchscreen on this vehicle. And it's been a big, big change. One of the things you obviously can't see um, on the video or, or feel in the video is the, the change in the sound deadening on it. The previous one was pretty loud from the exhaust and the road noise. Um, kind of made it hard to even hear the stereo. On this one, it is a completely different beast. You can live with it. It could be a, a great daily driver or a long distance drive. If you have a long commute, you know, you're driving on the highway, you can have the stereo on, or if you don't want that, it's not gonna be so loud. It's not gonna beat you up like the previous ones did, which is a nice big change for this car. And that was just a quick kind of wrap up of the 2022 WRX. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to our team here at Reliable Subaru in Springfield, Missouri.